Hello YouTube, it is Damien, it's the Rise of AEFC, and it is episode 10, and it's a big one, it's the Elimination Final Adelaide Oval, as you can see here we finished third on the final day, the game that you didn't see, we drew one one to Brisbane, um, it was a kind of a game that we just rotated a little bit, make sure people didn't get suspended for this game, um, um, if you get suspended in the final game, you do miss the Elimination Final, but yellow cards don't carry over if you have a one yellow card away, so by resting Bolland and stuff, we actually, uh, everyone's um, not got a disciplinary uh, problem now, which is good. We conceded to an 82nd minute corner, unfortunately for us, it's just how it goes, and because of that and Perth Glory winning, we finished in third, so if we do win this game, we do play Perth Glory. Um, which will obviously be a tough tie, but we'll see how we go over there in Perth. That'll be next episode. We're not going to do it all in one big episode. We're going to do this episode, next episode, and episode after as well, um, if needs be, in the grand final, which will probably get to Western Sydney because they are really strong. But we'll see how we go. And the Twitch chat is alive and well. As always, link in the description below. Come follow us on Twitch. Follow us on Twitter so you know when we are going live on Twitch and to keep updated with my saves and my long-term save coming up as well. But let's get into it. We're going to submit the team. We're going to take a look at the team. It is your straightforward team. Galakovic, Moreno, Yakovic. I've gone with Wilkinson over Taylor Regan, just. Galloway, you say is Bolan. Um, Essien, we got rested as well. So Vinny Lee is going to come into there. Halloran, Goodwin, and Vinicius is going to play up front with Jute coming in off the bench. In the Twitch chat, let me know what you think. Are we going to beat Sydney FC? It's going to be a big game here. Hopefully we can. Hopefully we will. Because I don't want this to be the end of the uh, stream and the end of um, this season's episode. I want to make the final. And whatever happens there happens. We are favourites of the game. Go out there. Essien looks um, quite upbeat for it. I'm very happy with that. Uh, I'm going to set the instructions there. We know that Lafondre is their star man. Um, you know, he's very good as Lafondre. We know about De Jong. He's quite good. And Nikovic as well is a gold card on FIFA. People don't know. Um, he's like 75 rated. Amari's their key signing, but I don't rate him. They're a very good side here. On the bench, they've got Sisak. Um, Dragovic is another goalkeeper. Mark Tilio, Seda Mid, Franzia, and Mitchell Evans as another goalkeeper. So still in problems. So you have three goalkeepers on the bench because of problems with their squad. I'm not... Um, we feel glad in very good via. We're obviously playing at Adelaide Oval instead of Highmarsh, which I hate. But in front of the Highmarsh... Uh, in front of the Adelaide Oval faithful, even though it doesn't look like anything like Adelaide Oval... We'll go. I actually make high marsh look like high marsh, which is good on the game too. Anyhow, I'm looking for us to start well. At the moment though, we haven't kept the ball well at all, and it's all Sydney FC. Never mind, there we go. But highlight, Galloway, actually going to move it to key um, extended highlights for a cup for the playoffs. And off we go. De Silva, Nikovic, I need a drink. We get a cheeky drink in as De Jong finds Lafondre. Lafondre now, it's a good boy in the Nikovic, finds De Silva. De Silva now with the ball, looks inside. Nikovic, and we're 1-0 down here in the playoff semi-final, the quarter-final of the playoffs. We haven't started this shaky in a game for a very long time. And Lafondre finds Nikovic, finds De Silva, then gives too much room there to Nikovic inside. And just a nice strike. And Galakovic won't save that one. We're 1-0 down. Just going to tell everybody to get creative, get on the ball. Can we find it? We can't afford to be 2-0 down. We've been quite good at home. So it would be strange. As Wilkerson wins it, finds Vitisic. Vitisic's ball, that's great in the Halloran's feet. Chance to run in at him. Still with Halloran. Still with Halloran. Still with Halloran down this right side. Good ball in. Vitisic flick on. To no one at the back post. And it is going to just be 1-0 still. 16 minutes played. Expecting this to be quite the contest, considering us conceding early. I know that we have the attacking threat. We had trouble scoring against Brisbane, though, and had trouble scoring against Melbourne. But we'll see how we go. De Jong, though, over the top. Still with De Jong, he's hit the post, and Galavic claims. Giving us a little bit of trouble, are they, uh, Sydney FC? But we'll see how we go. Jakobsen, though, goes long, finds Halloran. Halloran there, in the end, it is a pointless highlight, and off we go. Going to continue forward here. The system is working, but not as well as normal. Not as much possession as normal, not as much shots as normal. We'll see how we go. We will change it to 4-2-3-1 if needed, but Bola now on the free kick. It's a decent ball in back post. Lafondre heads away, but only as far as Goodwin. Bola with a chance to cross again. In the end, he finds Goodwin tackled. Referee says nothing untoward, and it's De Jong on the break. And here comes Sydney FC again. Sydney FC, ball in Nikovic. There's a good ball to Lafondre. He's 1v1 with Galakovic. Oh, Galakovic has been tall there. He stood big, and we have a great save as Eugene Galakovic in goals. Once again, bailing us out. It's not been good from us at all. Halloran finds Vitisic. Vitisic now, us on the re-break. Doesn't happen, though, as a nil tackles, and that will be that. Getting a little bit warm in here. It is like 30-odd degrees.
Daniel De Silva, though. There we are. Gets up a booking. Red main now. Goes long. Should be able to win it with our height at the back. What has Wilkinson done there? Lafondre's in. Finds De Jong. Hits it. Wilkinson, 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 Wilkinson. Why? Why, Wilkinson? What have you done? We've put him in because he's technically a better centre-back than um, Tyler Regan. I guess there's a case to say that Tyler Regan and uh, Jakobsen have a very good partnership. But Wilkinson's obviously the better player. That's a great strike. And we're 2 new down. We will change it at half-time if we have to. Going to tell him just to get creative. Trying to work one back. We've dominated the ball, but we haven't created anything clear-cut. Craig Goodwin, though, picks up a booking. We're 2 new down here in the quarterfinal of the cup, of the playoffs. It looks like, as things stand, we are going out. Shock at high, at high load over. We're going to go out at Sydney FC, who we've beaten a couple of times this season. And that will be half time. All right, we need to dig deep, here, dig deep here. So, Jacobson and Wilkerson are not having the best of times, but that's fine. I'm actually going to just get very aggressive with the lads. Get to the tactics screen. We are going to switch to the 4 2 3 1. We're going to go to very attacking very early. Um, I'm going to go with a little bit wider, a little more, more direct. No, no time wasting. Don't care about working into the box either. If you want to swing it, swing it. Um, who's not played well out of the midfield? Everybody. Got to drop Essien. Vitus is going to come back one. And Bruce Chate is going to come out there. as a target man on attack. Could have moved Bolland in there, but we won't. Um, going to go to attack. Issa Gears and Bolland. I think Issa Gears is more suited to this game. Because we need his passing. Goodwin's on a booking, but that's fine. Half-time change. Bruce Gitte's out there. We change the game. Essien's off. And off we go. I'm not scared to make the big call. As much as I don't like taking Essien off, because I know he can change a game. So can Issa Gears and so can Bolland. At least the least can release Bolland a little bit more. And we're being overrun in the middle of the park as well. Galloway, Vitasic now. His ball into the box. It's clear by McGing. And as far as Wilkinson though, his ball finds Galloway. Can we find this goal? Ball back post. Halloran heads down. Jitte! Come on! Big bad Bruce off the bench. And it's 2-1 early doors. We needed an early goal off the half time. And Jitte makes it 2-1. 46 minutes played. It was a good ball there to Wilkinson. Oh, good ball there to Wilkinson. Wilkinson picked up the poor ball there. It was a good ball in the back post. Halloran, intelligent knockdown. Bruce Jitte, the man for all moments, gets it. But it's another highlight there. De Jong now in there. Hits Anne Agonmanusson. I don't know. Silver, what a ball. Nikovic, Galakovic catches. What name is that? We need to know his first name. Where is it? Starts with an A. B. Adrian. Andrea. I can pronounce Andrea. Andrea. There. 53 minutes played. We've changed the system. We'll see how it works. Andrea's on it again. Number 33. Ina De Jong. Hits it blocked. Andrea from distance over the bar. And there we go. 55 minutes played. Going to leave it. I was going to tell him to push forward, but maybe a bit early. Goodwin's not having the best of times. Isai is. He can hit a free kick. Isai is. He's hit the post. Jitte! 2-2. Two, two. Bruce with two off the bench. There we go. What a goal, son. There we are, and Jitte again, and bang, 2-2. Two, two. There we are, long ball, McGing, finds De Jong, De Jong now, what a game, this game's crazy, De Silva, Lafondre's in here, Nikovic it is, Nikovic, Galakovic, what a block! For all money you thought Nikovic was going to score, Galakovic came out and made himself huge! What a game indeed, Timmy! Nikovic, though, heads it away. Where does Wilkinson and Tillo now on that again? Going to leave things as it is. I'm not going to change back to the other system. Goodwin's off here. He's in trouble. Wow, I thought he was off. Goodwin gets away with one. With that in mind, Ryan Kiddo. Out he goes. He's growing to quiet the player. To long ball over the top to Jitte, though. I don't know who it was from. Jitte with a chance for a hat trick. Oh. Big bad Bruce. He's nearly come back and done the job. Kiddo on. Straight after seeing Goodwin nearly getting sent off. Kiddo, kiddo's on. I know Goodwin's probably our best player, but oh well. Him and Bolland. Kiddo's on it though. It's an early ball in. Jide! Oh, he didn't get up. Bolland heads down. Halloran now. He's in the box. Still Halloran. Cuts it. Blocked. Andrea away. Can they break in the FC? Is it going to fall to Jakobsen? It does. Jakobsen down the line. Morone inside the Isaias. Isaias. Vidasic turns off the post. Halloran! 
on! Come on, boys! From 2 0 down the 3 2 in the quarter final of the cup. There we go, of the playoffs, sorry, not the cup. It's not the FA Cup, it's the playoffs. Morone, Isaias, Vidasic, what a strike. It deserved to go in, but Halloran makes it 3 2. I'm going to stay on the same system to about the 75th minute. There we go. Very good from the lads. Can we hold on? Can we find a fourth? What a game of football. What a comeback. Morone down the line. Halloran, Isaias, Vidasic over the top. GTA off the bench. GTA to make it four. GTA for a hat trick, Red Main. 3-2 still. What a save from Redmayne. What a game. The game sparked into all sorts of life. He say he is. It's four. He doesn't score from corners. He's a midget. But it doesn't care. The club cut that makes it four. And it's probably game over. From 2-0 down. I'd like to go 4-2. He makes a great one in. Beats somebody in the air. He's tall though. Beats Josh Brillante in the air. And that's 4-2. And he say he is. Can we make it five? Morone, Vidasic, Morone again, still with Morone, what a crazy game, the ball is picked up by Redmayne, what a crazy game of football, the stream isn't over ladies and gentlemen, I reckon we're going around again, I'm saying this and if Sydney score right now, squeaky bum time, squeaky bum time, Jitte though, wins it, falls to Jitte, good ball from the target man over the top towards Halloran but doesn't find him, We've pressed in here and run it with Morone. Switch out to the other side. Kido wins the knockdown. McGinn goes long. And look, they've got one over the top here. They want to find Lafondre. And he's quick, Lafondre. And he's there. Lafondre, 1v1. A good block there from Wilkinson. De Jong now on it. Still with De Jong. His ball top of the box. Find San Daza. And that's not going to be anywhere near it. Actually going to change back now to the 4 1 2 1 2. You see, this is going to go back a line. Vidic has had a good game. We're going to bring Vince Lear on and bring him in as a ball-winning midfielder on defend. And we are going to move back to that. And Jide's going to still go as a target man on support. Going to confirm those changes. A highlight after that as well. This game is kicking off. Can we now just keep the ball and just do what we need to do? Just concentrate, lads. Concentrate. Just keep the ball. We'll be okay. Going to go to a little bit more of a defensive mindset. Um, in transition, we're not going to slow down the pace. Going to regroup. Still looking to keep the ball, though. Just kind of slow this game down. Take the sting out of it. We should be okay. Hopefully. I'm happy with that. From 2-0 down at halftime to 4-2. Can we hold on? A goal for Sydney FC makes this interesting as anything. Morone's had a very good second half. Galakovic has made some saves. Andrea picks up a booking. 88th minute. We're going to get home. We are going to get home. It is fine. I'm not going to make a, any more changes before two up. We're home and we're hosed. That's good. 94th minute. There we are. Nikovic, long. Galloway heads. McGing. He will get on it to swing it in. Vinny Lear, great challenge. It's going to be full time, you would imagine. Oh, no, there's a minute to go. There's going to be a highlight, isn't there? Andrea, the silver now. Here we go. Sandaza from distance. It wasn't as far away as you think. That reminds me a bit of Sonny Luco from that far out. Anyhow, British Jitte's picked up a knock. He'll be okay. Morone, though, throws it in. Headed down. De Jong, Vinny Lear wins a bat. Referee, blow your whistle. Send us in to the semi-final against Perth Glory, please. Referee. Ref. Send us there. Galloway. Miko Bolland. Back into Galloway. It's surely game over, right, ref? There it is. The stress. Put 4-2. We have deserved that one. Sydney FC, that's the most tested side has given us at home all year. We've lost games at home, but that's the biggest. Galakovic made five saves, three key ones too. Brindley to come back at halftime, boys. What a game. What a, what a decision to move to the 4-2-3-1. The comeback king. Bang. Bruce Chitay's out for two to three days. That's fine. I'm going to attend the press conferences. It's important. Um, he's done well. Um, Vitasic was fine, I thought. I hope he would be able to make a pit pack and he done that. They're entitled to however they play. I don't really comment on it. It's fine. We face Perth Glory in Perth. That game is going to be in three days' time? Is it in three days' time? If it's in three days' time, we are going to do a doubleheader. This episode is going to be a doubleheader. Quarterfinal, semifinal, doubleheader. 
There we go. That's what we're going to do. For everybody on YouTube, we'll be right back to double header against... I've pressed the Steam Workshop again. Uh, it is going to be a double header, and the second game is going to be against Perth Glory. So stick around, as we will be there in just a second. Welcome back, YouTube. Semi-final time against Perth Glory. The final will be against Western Sydney as they beat Brisbane Raw. Can we do it? Hopefully we can. It's the same lineup, same bench. Jide's injured, but that's fine. He'll come off the bench and do what he needs to do if he has to. Let's go out there against Perth. A side that at Perth we have problems against. Can we do it though? Hopefully we can. The semi-final of the Hyundai A-League. Uh, they've got Chris out wide. Everyone knows Chris from Lazio. He's quite a player. Um, Charlie Harrell's on the other side. He's a very good player as well. Joining Brisbane Raw though. Um, Keo in real life is a bit hit and miss. Doesn't really score too much. And then he does score goals. Um, he scored 4-11 and 11 this season. Uh, Rashudo there, Isaiah, uh, Isaiah, a player that I'd really rate because of his physicals. Um, and at the back, they're not bad. Liam Reddy's a really good keeper for the level. Um, he's also joining Brisbane Raw. Um, Surrounded with Laurie and Scott Jamison. He's a little bit of a twat. You know, when he joined CNFC, he turned into a bit of a twat. So he didn't have the best of times here at um, Adelaide either. So you don't really like him, but he's okay. We're very keen to avenge what happened to it against Perth Glory last time. There's a lot more to come from you boys. Can we do it? Ask the assistant. Score predictions in the chat. Can we win the semi-final? I'm focusing on what we can do and not on our other people. Diego Castro is out. That's a big loss for Perth because he's one of their key players. Off we go. Bolan, Vidasic, and off we go. Hopefully we'll be okay. Essien finds Vidasic. Did take Essien at half time. It did work. If it didn't work, we definitely would have known about it in the comment section for sure. Early door throw in. Galloway. Flicked back by Goodwin to Galloway. His ball inside. A 3 1 win is what's being predicted there by Timmy Mig Fudge Nugget. He's a good lad, Timmy. There we are. Keo, though. 1v1 with Galakovic. Keo, Galakovic again. He's having quite the uh, quite the playoff series, isn't he? Uh, is Eugene. He's making some saves, the uh, legend of the club. And it's a corner to Bolan. Bolan's corner. Halloran. It's a foul on the keeper, hasn't it? VAR is waiting for Calcation. And what's a penalty? Wow, VAR's overturned it. It said it was a push from Williamson. Chance to go one new up. Jakobsen against Reddy. He scores. I'm in a bit of shock because I didn't think it was a pen. We're going to go back and watch it back. But Jakobsen 1-0. VAR says it was a penalty. That's a little bit controversy. A little bit of controversy. I can't pronounce it. A little bit of controversy. Let's have a look. Let's go to the highlight. We'll slow it down and we'll go to behind goals now. What do you reckon, chat? VAR overturning this. So Halloran's coming for it. Reddy's coming to punch. I don't know how that we've got a penny out of that. That's a fair by Halloran on Reddy. I want to see what it says. Halloran appears to have been shoved by William Wilson. Yeah, but Halloran committed the foul first before he was shoved by Wilson. Look. I'm going to take it, but I don't think we got a penalty there. I think VAR has made a mistake there. But there we go. We'll take VAR. Highlight. Isaias. Back stick. He swings it in. Galloway doesn't win it. Vitasic, though, again, playing as a false nine. Finds Galloway. Still with Galloway. Essien. Flicks on. Goodwin. Ready. Oh. Back to Isaias again. I don't know why Essien just didn't header it at goals. Isaias again. Good channels by Jundai. Apparently, it's a foul. There we go. Free kick. Isaias again. Crowding the keeper as we like to do. Back post headed away from Keo. It was a good whipping ball, but no one could get there. Galloway again on it, on the right-hand side. We play him on the left, but he's more natural on the right, so I don't mind that. Moroni gives it into Bolan. Mikko Bolan finds Mikel Sien. Isaias now again on the ball. Just a controlled build-up from us is what I like to see. Bolan, the overlap from Galloway. There's numbers in the box. We put my son. Back post. Hello! What a header! And it's 2-0 in the semi-final. And as things stand... The final against Western Sydney is happening. There we go. Isaias, Miko Bolan, his bull finds Galloway. Right across to the back post. I always wanted to say, I want you to whip that low. What a header from Halloran, picking out the top bins. We're 2-0 up inside 20 minutes. In saying that, though, that's what Sydney FC did to us, and we we went on to win 4-2, so it's not over. But I prefer to be in this position than being 2-0 down. Dominating... Not really dominating the ball as much as we do, but dominating in terms of chances. 
Jundai picking up a booking. Off we go. 25 minutes in, 26 minutes in, and we're continuing on. 30 minutes on. Still time ticking away. I'm happy if time wants to tick away. That's fine. Means that we don't have to make changes at the back. And as things stand, we don't have to bring Bruce off the bench, which means he can, you know, doesn't need to be injured. And he'll be okay. Highlight. Morone. Finds it's our years. Finds Morone. Still Morone. Essien. Finds Miko Bolan from distance. Blocked. Harold. Goodwin picks it up. End of the highlight. I am on extended highlights, so that is a highlight that is extended. Oh, on extended highlights. I'm not telling a lie. Half time, we're 2 0 up at half time. Sydney FC are in the same thing. Don't get complacent because Sydney FC did, and we beat them 4 2. Don't you dare against Perth Glory. They deserve to be beat by us. If we lose in the final against Western Sydney, so be it. Halloran gets tackled by Chris. That's the end of the highlight, and off we go. In terms of changes, he's like not having the best of games, but he's a more defensive player. Uh, we'd probably move. Essien back alongside Isaias yes, and goes to two defensive mid midfielders and bring Bolland off. But Bolland's having a good game too. It's interesting. We could just leave it as is. Galloway's not 100% fit. We are going to get Galloway off just because of his fitness. Uh, that means Tyler Regan's going to go out there. We're going to move Wilkinson out wide and we'll probably move... Mar no, we're going to leave it. Wilkinson can play out there unconvincingly, but he's okay in the role like it's unconvincing but he does the job wing back on support though not going to change the system we're going to make that one change scott galloway with that little little bit of uh fitness problem i just want to make sure that he gets home that we get home we win we win this game and we're there for the final 75 minutes played time ticking away again i am going to actually go to shut up shop bolan's had a great one i'm actually going to do this move vidasic there get essien in there we are going to bring Vince Lear on. Going to go to that and play an anchor man. And we are going to play Lear as a bit more of a ball winning midfielder on defend. We're going to move Miko Ball on upper line. We're going to go to that. And we're going to play him as a advanced playmaker on supports. Fine. Going to confirm that change. Go strikerless. Keep the same system. Still can't keep the ball. Off we go. 83 minutes played. 84 minutes played. Still pretty good. I'm now going to switch it to a little bit more defensive. But I reckon we're home and hosed. There we are, ladies and gentlemen. We've seen the game out well. We've kept the ball well. We've nullified Perth not much. And we are in the final of the Hyundai A-League regular season. There we are. Wilson throws it in. It'll be it'll be a little bit of a slate to concede because our performance has been so well. But it's offside. That should be that. We are in the final of the Hyundai A-League. Now, usually I would wear a suit for this occasion. It is 32 degrees. I haven't turned the fan on because I haven't wanted to stop the stream because it's been hot. And it is my beta save. So we're not going to wear the suit. But I'm definitely, if we make the finals in our long-term save and in the FM19 EPL important games, we'll put the suit on. But not for this one. I'm going to attend the assistance. It's terrific performance. Um, who do I think will win it? Uh, my players aren't uh, there, so none of the above. There we go. Because I think... Um, would I give it to anybody? To be honest, anyone from our squad, I wouldn't give it to. Anyone from Western Sydney squad, I would. Anyhow, that's the final. We're in the final against Western Sydney. That is in four days' time. Why? So it's not like this in real life. It's every weekend. But it doesn't matter. That's going to be its own little episode. All right, guys, ladies and gentlemen, boys. So everybody in the YouTube, I hope you enjoyed um, this episode. Link in the description below to the Twitch um, and to the Twitter so you can keep up to date. But the final of... The of the grand final of the Hyundai A League season is going to be between Western Sydney Wonders and Adelaide United. When Adelaide United won their first ever title, we beat Western Sydney at Adelaide Oval. Is it a chance for Western Sydney to get redemption? Or are we going to do two over them in finals um, against Western Sydney? Hopefully, we can. Enjoy the rest of your day or night, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, wherever you're watching this from. This is Damien signing off with AUFC, that is Adelaide United. Have a good day or night, and thank you, and goodbye.